What's going on YouTube? Mater here. Well, I'm going to show y'all how I put these together. I know I've shown bits and pieces. But this is what I wound up doing with the Braun lights. How I get them hung up, as you can tell by this one up here. Got that one, and I actually got the one above me already hung. What I do is I take, and I just got through setting it down. Oh, it's over there. But anyways, what I'll do is get this hole drilled out right here on each end where the, the hook and everything is supposed to go through. But I put a, it's a 10 by 24 rib nut insert in there. First, you know, of course, get the hole drilled out. And you don't have to worry. I mean, if you're careful going drilling, as long as you don't, once it punctures, make sure that you pull it out because I don't know for sure what's up in there. I haven't taken it apart yet to look. But get it drilled out just a little bit bigger and oh uh, get the set out let's see for that 1964th drill bit is what you're going to need so and yes i'm using my the warrior titanium nitrate these i i do like i've picked up a second set i've not had a problem with them at all but um Y'all see me working with the wood I get. So basically, all I've done. All right, we'll get this here. Now wait, I'm going to shine it up in here some. That way I can see what I'm looking at too. But anyways, I just measure from. Oh, where is it? There it is. Measure from inside of here to the other side. Okay. And that tells me how wide that opening is. So then I just, uh, I already know this is like five or five eighths of an inch thick. So that's basically inch and a quarter. So whatever that measurement is between the opening, take it, you know, about one and three sixteenths of an inch off, make it that much shorter. Then since I'm doing end to face, what you need to do is, I mean, if you want to do it, you can, but I put glue on there. I put some glue on the end of it, on the end grain. Let it sit for about five minutes, because what that does allows it to absorb in there and get better. It makes it where it'll bond a lot better. Then I just go back, put more glue on it, and take my bread nailer, or finish nailer, whatever we'll call it, it's a 15 gauge. But I'll nail that on there. Center of it, what I do is I take um, the screw, which these are nothing more than, it's a 10 by, I think it's a 10 by 1, yeah, 10 by 1, 24 uh, Phillip um, combo, and I just take a regular flat washer. So, and then I'll take a, you know, this is 11 sixteenths, or not 11 sixteenths, but a, it's a 5 8 uh, spade bit, and go down in there after I've got the hole drilled, um, and that way it's countersunk. So, do the screw through here. Well, I know. Oh, don't tell me I grabbed the wrong one. I think I might have. No, bear with me. I. I Oh, I think I did. I have to drill that out real quick, a little bit better. I just do that. That way, that screw goes down in there easier. I don't know why it's not wanting to. But anyways, I'll do that. But. It's going. It's just wanting to be a little bit of a hemorrhoid. But all I do is I'll take, line it up on there. Get the screw to go in. And just get it screwed down on that end. 
but I didn't want to um, put all the, start putting all this together. That way, y'all couldn't see, and especially with the noise. I'm about moving my, I'm gonna get that set up there better. I'm trying to, I need. I'm I'm looking at getting a better camera. Try and move some stuff around. This is all I do. Makes it easy to you know, just get them tight. Don't have to over torque them because you're not holding a lot of weight. And kind of get them, you know, lined up. And so this one here, I know where it's going to have to go. Same way with that one because these are the plug in kind. Um. I can show it. Where's the camera at? Uh, there it is. As you can tell, you can link. These are the linkable ones. Now, unfortunately, Harbor Freight has done away with these. These are the 3500 uh, Braun lights. I don't know why they got rid of these. I actually like them. Um. But you can link up the, the way they got them set up is you can link up the four of them on one outlet, which is pretty good. And I mean, that's what I've got right now. So I'm going to get them uh, put up in there. And, but anyways, that's all it is to it. I mean, if you think about how to try and install one of these lights where, you know, you've got the rafters and everything, and you don't want to hang them. This is what I've come up with, okay? Uh, someone else that may not work, so someone else, oh, that would work perfect. But my little trick, tip, whatever, for hanging up these lights, as you can tell, I mean, I've got them. They're up there. They're not going anywhere. So, anyways, uh, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe, hit that bell, and of all things, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about these. Um, about this little hack on installing a brawn light from Harbor Freight. Until next time, y'all stay safe and God bless.